Change only occurs when the pain of staying the same finally outweighs the pain of the change. Does that make sense? Where I'm so uncomfortable not changing that I have to change now. Sometimes when you give people feedback, they change. Sometimes when you give people feedback, they reject it and they dismiss it. And we're going to talk about how to deal with those situations when they happen in a few minutes. But some people will not change until you force them to camp out in the discomfort of getting this feedback. When we talked about what are the consequences of not changing, you know what one of the consequences of not changing is? You and I having to have this conversation. That's a consequence. It's uncomfortable for me, it's uncomfortable for you, I'd rather be out there working, getting stuff done, but nope, we're in here talking about this. That's a consequence. And so we have to help people get uncomfortable enough to change. So the next time you think about giving feedback and you're worried about making someone feel quote unquote bad, differentiate between feeling bad about themselves because you're making a values judgment, as we've talked about with behavior. If you do this well, that won't happen. But don't shy away from making them uncomfortable. The psychology of behavior change tells us we have to make them uncomfortable.